bastard being killed? Yes. He was attacked by a stranger late in the night. It was awful. Amitabha. Let's go. <laughs> You feel no repentance and you're challenging us. All right. You think my leg kung fu is nothing? You now destroy my panther fist. <laughs> Tell me what'll be next. I know only your panther fist can do evil killing such as I have seen. From now on, I will be the most feared of all warriors. trace behind. We can't avenge him.
Mastermar, you know I've done nothing wrong. You exploited your reputation. You've raped another man's woman. How can you say that you're not guilty? It's not true. I obeyed your orders. Now you accuse me of all these ridiculous crimes. Eh. Just give half of your wealth to our master. Then everything will be all right. It's no good to you, huh? You know I'm right, huh? Huh? Damn you, you cur! What's that? And the same goes for all of you bastards! You scum! <laughs> you can't seem to decide whether life or wealth is more important. Now, woman, did that dog rape you? Speak, I said! Huh? Speak! Huh? Please, please tell them that, tell them that it wasn't me. Uh, you're guilty. You can't deny it now. You're guilty, you flea-ridden dog. You're lying. I'm no rapist. She cries out of fear. Fear of you. you you're the one that keeps raping her. <laughs> Why not admit it? I'll never admit it. You're the rapist. <laughs> Stop it! What did you just say? We are all followers of the Buddha. Why the whips? Can you show no mercy toward your prisoner? <laughs> you crazy monk! I look for our abbot's murderer. <laughs> well, in that case, then... You should mind your own business.
Everything's unclean in this world. Leave it for one instant, and it all is soiled. Everything. What the heck are you talking about there, huh? There you are. If I were to take your heart and filter it through here, I'd find I would dirt in it too. What? Now how are you gonna filter my heart through there? You tell me that one. I don't understand this. What's this? Think about it. Hey, come back! You're welcome. Please come right this way. Right this way. <laughs> I'd like a room for a few days. Oh, yes, certainly, yes. Oh, uh, yes. One second, I'll go find one for you. Right here. <laughs> Please register, huh? under the eaves, even from ten miles away, he'll be lured by its fragrance. inside your bag.
are you anyway? I'm a descendant of the great dragon himself. Don't give me any more trouble. <laughs> through. You're gonna try and cut it with that sword, all right? I simply can't resist. Now, can I play or not? Here's my money. But I'm warning you, I'm pretty good. All right. But hey, let's make the stakes even higher. I tell you what, I'm gonna bet all my takings from today on this. Right. You son of a gun. Mm, that's exactly how I'd want to play the game. <laughs> I really appreciate your zeal. Right, just to get things straight, let's do it. All my earnings from today, just in case I'm gonna lose my head. But I won't. <laughs> Don't get nervous. Let 
problem. Hey, you! <laughs> hey, you can't walk away like that. First you tripped me up and hurt me. What's wrong with you? Don't you think you should quit before you really get hurt? <laughs> For all I know, you've separated my vertebrae. I will. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, please forgive us. <laughs> <laughs> People say evil of you in this town, so I've come to give you a blessing. Buddha bless you. They all lie. The gang of Wudong has done this. They want us to join them. They've destroyed property, and they blame it all on us. The people misunderstand. 
Before you blame others, you should look at your own self first. Are you also here for trouble then? Is that it, huh? How can you say that? I am here to look for the killer of the Shaolin Abbot. That is my sole mission. Mind your own business. Please leave us alone. And what if I don't go? Then what'll you do? I can do nothing but fight you off. That's my only defense. <laughs> Have I really got no place in this world to go to? Must I beg for food? I thought your tongue was pretty good. Who, me? What are you talking about? Come on, don't be such a coward. Now, you listen, I don't fight with anyone. But we do. for me while I was gone. Oh, as a matter of fact, yes. Huh? He's right its way. Huh? <laughs> uh, uh. Huh? How can she disappear like that? Who was it? Your caller, a very pretty girl, oh yes. Not so. A girl? Should have been a man. Oh yes, she wanted to see you, really. I just can't figure out where she's gone now. <laughs> if anyone else comes for me, send them up to my room. Uh, yes, yes, of course, of course. Uh, I don't know, where could she have gone? What a coincidence. I thought for sure it was him. <laughs> Blush. Your visitor's here, sir. Mm. Mm. Hello, master. <laughs> I knew you would come. I had a dream that I would meet a pretty girl. So how are you? What's on your mind? Have a seat there. My name is Pinky Poon. 
It wasn't my fault. Please forgive me. Hmm? Oh. The purse, that's all right. You know, money should be kept moving from the rich to the poor. So don't you worry about it. Please. So, your name is Pinky Poon. Yes. Hmm. That's fine. You know, one of my best friends, little girl, is named Pinky. I'd like to invite you to share a cup of wine with me. I'd like to make up for my very bad behavior. <laughs> you know, we Buddhists don't take this wine quite so seriously. We call it rice kernel tea. But thank you all the same. seen you. I'll bet you talk. What do you want? Oh, it's you again. So you need another lesson, do you? Okay. Don't you fight with me. I'm pretty tough stuff. You're just a cheap little mongrel, that's all. You can take over as a beggar. <laughs> now relax. Do you like this? What earthly heaven is this? Hell's temptation is so sweet. But would you call this a sin? Don't you tempt me like this! I only wanted to please you, that's all. Buddha, have mercy on me. My flesh is so weak. Massa, may I come in? You may enter. Reporting for duty. Do you know that you are very late indeed? What is your reason? I had to travel 30 miles in just two days. I'm sorry. I should doubt your dedication to the cause. Spare me. Have mercy on me. Spare me. Please. Have mercy on my soul. I don't want you around. If you won't have me, I'll just lay down here all the time and die. Damn you, get up. I'll look on my shoulders. Huh? I'll fix you, you little. Shut up. That poor boy has no home. Surely you can employ him. Yes, yes, certainly. I will, but I'll be blessed. I'll have him right back. Hey, you. Now, no more monkey business. You've got that, OK? But of course, boss. Come on. Hey. I don't want you bullying that boy. I won't. You understand? Now go about your business. Come on. Mm. Now I have plenty bags right here. Now you're to move them without wasting any time. Have you got that? No problem. Oh, you're tough, all right. You bet. Ah, it was very good. 
<laughs> that was wonderful. Where did you learn that from? Huh? If your job depended on it, you'd do amazing things as well to keep it. Do you want to be my student? Much better than working around here. How about it? He's right, you know. This great master could tell you a lot more than you know about. Huh? You... Got it! You're the girl that was begging around the restaurant the other day. That's right. And can you guess who he is? He's the Grand Master of Shaolin Temple. Huh? Mm. Oh, you must forgive me. I'm really sorry. <laughs> uh, forget it. Will you follow me then? Gosh, I didn't know about that. Will, will you teach me the Shaolin Staff Kung Fu? Hmm? Staff Kung Fu? Yes. I'm told that every member of Shaolin learns this. Uh, you ask too much. Forget it. You forget that this is a great honor. Don't rush me. Please, I want you to tell me some more. <laughs> Greedy, you just mind that you don't ask too much of, of me. Of course not. I know how to strike a good bargain. Well, what's your offer then? How about we have a big contest then? And if I lose, then you make up the rules. <laughs> okay then, when do we start? How do we start? Now, that's the kind of talk I like to hear. Now, miss, you'll be witness to this big contest. All right. Shall we go? <laughs> you bet. lost. Mm -hmm. So what do you have to say? I got nothing to say. I'm only a student. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I want to leave here now. Well, certainly. We'll go then. <laughs> student? All right. I was thinking just now. Did you and the abbot ever fight? I mean, really hate each other? Yes, but Master is a man of Buddha. He has no time for hate. To be his student is really a great honor. <laughs> Did you really like each other? 
<laughs> they did. Let's rest here. I'm tired. Thanks. Master, I'm really very hungry. Please, can I have some? Hey, if you get so tired after caring so little, how can you be my student? What is that? Has the sun gotten to you? <laughs> There's a lot of dust in the water. You must filter it out. Otherwise, it could be bad for you. If you're going to be our teacher, you're going to have to smarten up. <laughs> Listen, Master. It is all our fault. Mm. Won't you please lift us out of our ignorance and show us Kung Fu? We really want to learn it. Won't mm. you please show us? Mm. Not right now. Um, I'll teach you when we get to Chan's village. Huh. That's such a long way. It's over a hundred miles. By the time we get there, I'll have lost interest in learning your style of kung fu. Eh. Uh, take this. It'll keep your mouth shut. Yeah. Hmm. Where are you going? Hey, have you forgotten? She's a woman. She's got to do it in the bushes. That's right. I'll be right back. <laughs> Go on. Hmm. <laughs> How dare you assault that woman? Release her at once. <laughs> Who are you? He's a master of Shaolin Temple. Shaolin Temple? Hmm. That's right. And if you had any sense, you'd get out of here right now. My name is Fighter Yang. I have walked three whole months to challenge this very man to a duel today. And now I have my chance. <laughs> Go on, Master. You teach that guy a good lesson. Hmm. Now's your chance to show us. I was losing just then. Why didn't you come and help me? If you'd have taught me your Shaolin Kung Fu, hey, hey, I could have helped you. That doesn't make any difference. You should have helped me. No. What's that? You need him? Listen to me. If I beat him, then I'm your teacher, okay? What's that? Otherwise, consider it lost. All right. It's a deal. Go ahead. Hmm. We've made a deal. You're my witness. Who are you? Master student. I'm called Dragon.
the dust off me. Mm -hmm. I said wipe it off. You should call me teacher. Mm -hmm. Teacher. <laughs> From now on, I'm the leader. Miss Poon. I'd like to be your student also. I'm not so sure. How can a woman be so reliable? You're really so wise. Keep waving! Take a rest? How can a student of mine be so weak? Huh? Hey, I'm really tired. And these things are so heavy. Tell me, how can we take revenge for the abbot? You need to strengthen your body, I think. Let's get going. Hey, I can't have a slash for a student. <laughs> you know, not far from here is my hometown. Please, let's take a rest there. I'll repay you for these. <sighs> repay me? But we can't stop. Now let's get moving. Come on. Oh, please. Enough. Oh, so many beggars. <laughs> been impolite to a monk. You should be punished. Huh. <laughs> Although you're in disguise, I know you're a master of the Shaolin Temple. Take it easy, miss. You know, if you're nice to our chief, he'll be nice to you. Here's the chief! Chief, chief. Are you the master of Shaolin Temple? Who wishes to take blood revenge for your dead, Abbot? I am. Please excuse me for treating an important guest like you. Release him, right now. Obey. Yes.
I appreciate your reception. Charming. I know you're here for a purpose. You'd best forget it while you live and breathe this air. Kurt Wong, it's still not too late to give up your ambitions. Come back to the ways of our Buddha. You still have a chance not to die. Now get out of here. If you force me, my only way is to still your evil heart. Destroy you, you self-righteous dog, you. Don't think you can stop me by killing my mortal body. What rubbish. Come here and lick my feet, then I might consider letting you go. Remember I mentioned to you about that girl? Hmm. Hmm. Take her inside. Yeah. This is your room. You'll work for the chief. And you better please him. You understand?
Don't be afraid of me. <laughs> hey, hey, you! Give me some water. I'm mm. thirsty. Where is it? Mm. I need some water. <laughs> <laughs> What's this? The chief asked me to bring this fruit for you two. Oh, <laughs> oh thank you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Two days to seize this fellow. Yes. Feel better now? Thank you very much. If not for you, I would have died. Don't talk like that. Now, you mustn't say anything anymore. You have to rest yourself. And you must be quiet now. The man who saved you will bring you some medicine very soon.
It's you. I have decided to follow the dragon, in spite of all the risks that pose a threat to my life. <laughs> that day in the rice fields, I decided to let you win, to lure the dragon out. Hey, come on. <laughs> Chief, Dragon has escaped. How can you be under Chief of the Wudong School, the greatest school in the entire world? I have lost face. But he is wounded and could not have run a great distance. I will continue to search with my men. Attention, you. Search every tree. We must have him back. Or there will be dire consequences. Yeah! <laughs> Dragon, please come now. Your breakfast is ready. It'll get cold. Thank you, Miss Boone. You're very kind. Don't you worry. When the time comes, I will take revenge for the abbot and our loved ones who have died at their hands. I stand with you, because I know you will take revenge against the Wudong school. They're devils. I would rather die than leave them to commit more of their evil ways. Okay, let's eat now. Come. Nothing, sir. Search over there. No, yeah, sir. Yeah. Right, man. Let me do the laundry, all right? Are you sure about that? I don't mind. Come on.
Thank you, Master. Thank you very much. You've improved. Hmm. <laughs> Good. In a little while, Dragon will come for you. This time, you will die with him. I wanted to die a long time ago with my father, who also died by your hand. He was killed by you about ten years ago. Then you are... I'm the daughter of Poon Young Hoi. You killed him ten years ago. <laughs> Poon Young Hoi? <laughs> woman now. Slowly. Don't try anything. You'll have to lick my feet again first. Or do you think I can't humiliate you still more? 
I have knelt before you once before. For that I burn with vengeance. I will never allow myself to do it again. You just want my throne, that's all. You're very jealous, you filthy dog.
Tell me, where do we go from here? There's a temple on the hill. Let's get married. remember I'm the man that you threw over so that you could marry him back ten years ago I wanted you so that's why you killed him you will never know the pain now I have avenged all those years I spent alone without you my loved one dear I came back to take you and your son home with us you men go and get the child sir don't you go no just wait, please! Don't you get it? You will scare him. I'll go and get him myself. Go and get him. Lovely woman. Damn you, blasted woman! Go and find me that child. I want him right now. Get moving. Sir. Sir. Now I must make sure that I kill your entire family. God 
Damn you, you bastard! <laughs> Sir! We can't find anyone out here at all! Get that child! Sir! <laughs> I've come too late. Uncle Yin! Uncle Yin! Teacher, please let me avenge my family's death. I am a man, and now it is time for me to pay their debts. Yin Chi Liang, I've been expecting you to say that for a very long time. Long ago, when you were just born, your father was in China studying there. With his very best friend, Wong Ho Ching, you were all that he ever talked about. Wong's only child was a baby girl. Your father's married you then. You find the girl with the other half of this medallion. And you take very special care of her. 
She is your wife. Someone says, you're in very great danger here because of what you've been saying. If you have to speak on the crimes committed by Ma Si Bing, then you better do it on your own. Or you'll make all your family suffer. And you know that I'm right. If you carry on, he won't forgive. He will kill all of you. There's no reason for him not to kill me. I won't bow down to that bastard. Whatever he does to me. Who's that? It's me, friend. You dare to show up here? Damn right I do. You filthy bastard! <laughs> Much later, when I'd fully regained consciousness, Wong had been dead for quite a long time. And his little girl has not been heard of since then. No one has seen her. You're a fool if you try to say that you're strong enough. You cannot beat him, not in a million years. You're not yet ready. You must take things slowly. Learn to fight him. And then when you're very certain, no one will be able to stop you. Teacher. Not yet. Teacher, I... Killer has arrived here in our town? Yes, my commander. It's an insult to my authority. If someone dares to kill here, you incompetent idiots had better finish him off. Go and get him. Come back when you kill him. You halfwits. Did you not hear me? Huh? <laughs> commander, D don't worry about the flute man. We'll kill that murdering assassinator. Mm. <laughs> you will die if you fail me. Now get out and kill that bastard. Kill him! <laughs> if you can really get him, I'll see that you're rewarded well. Huh? <laughs> then I'll not deny you, sir. 
Go now. You hear me? You men had better keep much closer guard from now on. I don't want any more trouble. See to it that everyone is checked from now on. Get to your post! Sir. Anyone who criticizes or shows disrespect to the government will suffer the consequences. The Commander Marcy Bing. Come in, sir. Come in. What can I get for you? Right there. Right there, sir. Uh, what are you having, sir? Maybe some dumplings, sir. Huh? Ah, yes, 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 yes. Here you are, sir. Um, where do you come from, sir? You're not from here. Where I come from? Ah, yes, sir. <laughs> Ah, yes. Um, uh, I haven't seen you before here. You'd better be careful what you say here. Many bad people staying here in our town. Keep yourself to yourself, or you'll find that people around here would cut your throat as soon as look at you. Who's there? Sir, I hope I find you well. Mm. Is it true that a guest at the Dragon Lake Hotel killed some of my people and... What in God's name do you think that you're going to do? Is it true, you idiot? Yes, more strange, Commander, sir. Korea is where he says he comes from. Hey, Korea? He must be the one that we're after. Go get him. Right. We must kill him. I will catch him and kill him. And he's as good as dead. And I will get a reward and... Then I'll be rich. I'll be rich. <laughs> go out and kill him. There. Oh, oh, God bless you, my lord. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Mind your own business.
What's that? Our men were beaten up. Can you not even handle one Korean? Can't you kill a man for me? There's obviously many more than just one of them. And they're obviously coming after me. Have you managed to find out anything about the one that pays the fruit? Have we met before? You're not a, a friend of the Lord of this place. Your name is Yin, I'm right? Oh. Mm. Let me tell your fortune for you. It's for free. Go on. Can you learn to cherish even people that you hate now? Only if you can do this can you find peace within yourself. Carry on and you'll find life very bad. I see this clearly. You're a damn silly woman. Say what you like. I don't know why you're after Ma Si Bing, but I think you should give up. Try it and see if what I have been saying is the truth. You keep quiet. <laughs> why are you so damned angry? Touching a sore point, am I, my friend? Why don't you beat the hell out of me? Hmm. Someone has sent their hunting dogs out for us. Coming at the front of Ma Zibin's pack is Tu Chan Fu, the dog. Chan Yu Fu is next. Then comes Pan Chan Fu. Maybe if you manage to stay alive for more than the next few seconds, I'll tell you what my real name is. Come in, come in. <laughs> Please, sir, I need your help. Come in, sirs. Come in right this way. Come on. Take a seat, that's it. Over here. There, there.
compare our skills. Help me beat these bastards. Wait a minute. I would like to become a student of your Commander Ma. Could you take me to see him right away? Mm. She could help me get that killer. Mm. <laughs> sure. You can be certain you'll be his student. You can really fight, even though you're only a girl. Let us see if you're as good as they say you are. And if you are really capable of beating all three of them, then I will set you free. Too young!
up that! Tell me now, want to still be a hero? You tell me the truth of why you really wanted to come here, and I still might have the heart to let you go. Koreans are not afraid of dying with honor. We Koreans are brave. Honor? <laughs> now, you'll beg to talk before this day is over. <laughs> if you tell me the truth, I'll help you get out. If you think that we don't want to cut you up, you'd better think again. I could kill you now. Maybe I'll tell you one thing. As long as I'm still alive, then I shall try and see that bastard dead. Damn you, you filthy bastard! Ah! <laughs> Now, will you swear always to serve me faithfully? Yes. Tell me, dear, would you be prepared to prove what you just said? Yes. I will go and kill the flute player for your men. Then I'll have proof that I'm faithful. Good. Take her and give her our best room. Yi Piao! Sir. Tell me, my man. Korean has said why he came here yet? We'll know soon.
You stay there. My God! What's happening, you damn silly bastard? I'm here alone. It's so quiet. Quietest place for me to bed down. Poor little girl, why are you here alone? You running from Ashi Bing? I guess so. This must be my lucky day. All you people carry lots of money. Have you got some? Uh, not even a penny. Mm, not just one cent, and there's no point in my robbing you. Get out of here before they catch up with you. Sorry, mister. I'll repay your kindness someday. You'll see. Goodbye for now. Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> you have no need to worry. Now that you owe me a favor, sometime soon you'll pay me back. Now, while there's still time, I'd get the hell out of here if I were in your shoes. I'll find you. Go on. Off with you now. See you then. chance to repay the favor. When I've got you, then I will get all that reward. Closer and I will kill him.
<laughs> Please don't hurt me. <laughs> Teacher! Teacher! You were a man. Could you not have done what you were told and waited a while? Now you've learned to be sorry. But then, sorry has no meaning. Teacher! <laughs> You're a man, not a baby who has learned nothing else but to cry. Teacher, tell me what I must do then. I see. You will listen now, will you? Yes. Well then, something good in you has been saved. Don't count on what you've already learned to protect you. You must know that you still have much to learn now. Change the ways of your thought. If you will listen only to me, then we will learn together ways to make Ma regret that he ever lived. Are you ready? Huh? Teacher, she told my fortune once before. You must be the ones who the government are after. If you hand us in, you stand a good chance of getting a big reward all for yourself. <laughs> Never would I give away someone for the sake of some money. Tell us then, what do you want? I just want to complete what I set out long ago to accomplish. The reason that she fought with me was because she was trying to get into Ma's palace. If you don't dare to venture anything, you will get nothing back in return. Good. If fate is with us, we will meet again. So, she was the one who saved me when I was trapped inside the palace. Ignore all worldly thoughts and practice your internal technique.
Now practice your external technique. Yes. Are you a man or just a crawling kid? Get on with your work. Yes. Welcome. Welcome. Move. Give me a reason. Why in God's name you built this shed right here along this road? Heart, sir, it's my living. When the hell has there ever been any business along this road? Oh, I'm a poor one, please. Get her. Oh, no, 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 oh, please. no, 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 What is this? When the hell was this shed built? A couple of days back. You should know that sheds have never been allowed to be built here. What can we do? She's no more than an old one. We'll see. Serve us, old woman. Yes. Very good. Oh, very good. What can I get for you, sir? <laughs> Just take a seat where you are. <laughs> Go and get her something and make it pretty quick. Yes, yes, yes. Just a moment, sir. There's the Korean. The flute man. That cunning woman. We must catch one of them. Then we will have accomplished the task that was set us. But we have only five days to lay hands on one of them. Tricky. Is the commander going to hold a big party on his birthday? <laughs> now, here we are. Here are some drinks for you. Is there anything else you would like? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Hmm? 
I bet you anything that you like that we will be invited there. <laughs> Damn you, woman. You think that we three are all damn stupid. You're the only fool. Now you'll regret tricking me. You'll never be able to do this again. Back you lot. Someone's coming through. Make way there. Make way. What a good example of what will happen to you if you don't respect the government. Take a good look. the deaths of my mother and father. Stay right there, please. Where you are? Where are you going? My son died suddenly over the weekend. I'm taking him to town. Open to up and let me see. Tell me, is it necessary to put me through all this? Put it down. I'll take care of them. Yeah. 
You are very brave, but stupid, too. Maybe I'll give you one last chance. All you have to do is tell me where the Korean and musician are hiding. What good is it for you to protect them? I, I, I don't know. Now I'll get it out of you. <laughs>
<laughs> At last, damn you, you're here. We won't let you get away this time. You aren't going to live much longer. You know that you've had it now.
Hey, what the hell's happened?
Teacher! This young lady's your wife. Can you forgive me for what I've done? 